Hi guys, Luna here and welcome back to another Warzone update video. Season 6 is here and I'm going over all the changes in today's patch notes. If you want to see all of the new content added in a bit more detail then you can check out my previous video. I'm going to go over the changes in the patch notes but I will recap all of the new stuff added for the season. Let's jump into it. The Season 6 update is around 31GB on all platforms and it's out now. With Season 6 we have new weapons, new operators and a new battle pass and new changes in Verdansk like these fissures and bunkers. We also have the Halloween event coming on October 19th with info on the event arriving on October the 18th so check that out when it happens. New weapons include the .410 Ironhide shotgun, the Grav Assault Rifle and the Battle Axe melee weapon all available now in game. The Apama Submachine Gun and Hammer and Sickle will be part of the Halloween event, so those will come in a few weeks. And there are also two new operators added, Alex Mason and Fuse, who is available to buy as part of a bundle. In-game, the Gulag has been changed to be more similar to the original Gulag, and loot across Verdansk has been adjusted as follows. The Ironhide and the Grav have been added to ground loot. There's new Gulag loadouts and new ground and supply box loot as well. Plunder respawn behavior has been updated to provide players with more dynamic infiltrations, and the RCXD killstreak has been removed from all modes until further notice because there is an issue with it. There has also been some buffs and nerfs to weapons and attachments, starting with assault rifles. The C-58 has had its recoil increased, the EEM-2 has had its recoil increased as well. To LMGs, the MG-82 has had its gun kick increased, recoil increased, reload interruption time increased and raise interruption time increase and the light machine gun alpha has had a gun kick increase and a recoil increase for attachments the tiger team spotlight movement speed multiplier decreased from 3.2 to 3 and adds movement speed multiplier decrease from 3.2 to 3 probably the right decision because most people are using the tiger team spotlight right now for the magazines on the OTS 9 the spetsnaz 40 round Adds speed multiplier decreased from 0.85 to 0.835, reload time decreased from 2.6 to 2.7, and reload empty time decreased from 3 to 3.1. And the VDV 40 round fast mag for the OTS 9 has had its add speed multiplier decreased from 0.8 to 0.78, reload time decreased from 1.93 to 2.11, and reload empty time decreased from 2.23 to 2.32. And last but not least, guys, we have a whole bunch of bug fixes including weapon bug fixes like camera tilt issues with the Krig 6 and hitching with the QBZ, hipfire radical was not firing properly on the Tech 9 for example, and other ones you can see on screen. And don't forget, because this is the final season, regiments are now frozen, so to ensure a smooth transition over the next clan-based system coming later this year, players will no longer be able to view their regiment roster and inspect other players. Guys, that is it for the patch notes of the Season 6 update in Warzone. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated with Warzone and Battlefield 2042 as they happen. Have an awesome day, and I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye.